Welcome back to The Helpful Home. I'm Sunday Dawn, and this is another weekly Trader Joe's haul. Um, I think I'll just kind of start by giving you an overview. I bought quite a bit of protein. We've got some ground turkey, some natural pork chops, some beautiful organic lean beef. We're going to do patty melts with later. I will do a cook with me. Um, they have a beautiful selection of goat milk cheeses. So if you're dairy-free, try out Trader Joe's goat milk cheeses. They are beautiful, tasty, affordable. They have a goat milk cheddar and gouda, which is unheard of. I did pick up some tofu for a tofu scramble. We will do a cook with me, I believe, next week on that. So if we have any um, egg allergy watchers, um, a tofu scramble, some turmeric, and some you know, vegetables, and turkey bacon, and you can make a good, satisfying, fake scrambled egg. So we will go through that next week. Here's some of our meat for our dinners this week. If you watch Meal Planning Monday, we're going to do a chicken thigh recipe with honey soy, and they only had tenderloins, so I'm rocking what they got. And here, if you are gluten-free and you haven't had a nugget in forever, Trader Joe's just came out with gluten-free chicken nuggets. Not clean eating, but spectacular. And also, keep your eye on this cornstarch. Non-GMO cornstarch, Rumford brand, was from Kroger. But good thing to have on hand. And here we are at the produce table. I have got my favorite butter lettuce um, and some organic baby spinach. The broccolini, and here I think they just call it organic baby broccoli, but I think it's traditionally called a broccolini. Drizzle that in some oil and hit it with some Himalayan salt and broil it, and it's my family's favorite veggie. Um, I also have some organic just cut broccoli for um, pasta primavera. Honey crisp apples, again, they're delicious. I believe they're $2.69 or $2.99. And then, uh, as far as dairy-free viewers, I have the Mexican-style roasted corn. There's dairy in the sauce and the cheese. They also just have organic sweet corn, and they also have roasted corn in a bag. Um, the ingredients are just roasted corn. So on a night where we have that roasted corn, it's nice to have a uh, side dish for my daughter who doesn't eat dairy. The sugar plum organic tomatoes, oh my word, I am a very picky tomatoer. I actually often say I don't like tomatoes, but I like a good garden tomato. My husband does a beautiful tomato garden in the summer, and I love those. And these right on the sign, they say, the best tomato this time of year, and they really are. So thanks for stopping by. Hope you follow along with our meal plan this week, and I will see you for some cook with me's tomorrow.